no room for certificate forgers in the elections. Supreme Court says, but well, what is this statement supposed to mean? Does it mean that the election system does not allow certificate forgery or that certificate, uh, certificate forgery cases are not covered in our legal system? We need to understand what the uh, Supreme Court mean by this statement. So let's dive straight into the depth of this matter. No room for certificate for just in elections. Okay, Supreme Court says. The Supreme Court on Friday said anybody found to have four certificates to seek qualification to contest for any elective position in the country will not be allowed because of the criminality involved. Bagam. The Appeals Court said the issue of certificate forgery to secure eligibility for election is a serious issue that must not be allowed in the country's uh, polity. Just, uh, Justice Bade said that Supreme Court, being the highest court in the land, must take the lead in righting the wrong so as to bring sanity into the murky water of the country's electionary process. Now let me say it here. Okay, categorically and with emphasis that this court, being the highest court in the country, must rise and take the lead in righting the wrongs in our electionarian process. Hmm. So this, if this is coming from a justice, justice body, then it therefore means that uh, <laughs> somebody is smelling something is smelling here. Eh, if woman will say, "I go the nakreta," if we say, "Roman say, "Mami water." Uh, the case has landed and that is if the supreme court will have the courage to stand up to you know to defend this whole truth because generally elect, uh, uh, certificate forgery is perjury it is a criminal offense and should not be allowed in our system that is fraudulent that is electoral electoral fraud okay and should not be allowed that is imp uh, what they call impersonation okay so there are a lot of million ways it can be interpreted it is a big sin in the legal system or in the judiciary system and it's an integrity issue so if somebody who is forging certificate can become a leader then what is next is going to finish the country so now that justice Bade has said this will the chief justice of the federation uh, justice uh look at the uphold this truth and sanctity will he do that that is the truth. The Supreme Court justices that will, that will sit on this matter, will they uphold this truth? Because already the APC has pocketed the judiciary in Nigeria and they already raising their own propaganda from yesterday to this morning now to counter whatever document that Atiku has received from the Chicago State University in the U.S. to validate Tinubu's office to make sure that they don't unseat him. We know that it's difficult to unseat a sitting president, but when the case is becoming so fraudulent, so conspicuous, and bringing national disgrace to us in international scene, then it becomes. If, in fact, if this issue is giving Nigeria an irreparable, irreparable global damage than is given to Tinubu himself that is involved in this matter, because the 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 the, the, the damage is given to over two hundred fifty million Nigerians home and abroad is worse than the damage is given to Tinubu himself. So indirectly, Tinubu's case is the one that is damaging Nigeria's integrity abroad. This is a very bad one, I tell you. So there are a few comments here. People are already saying that, uh, you know, if this is true, then um, again, let's see what uh, the judiciary at the Supreme Court level, the upper court of the land, will do about it. So I say so Tinubu is Bob Risky president. Bob Risky transgender. I'll be a trans uh transsexual. I'll be a cross dresser. <laughs> Bob Risky is a cross dresser. Okay. Um so somebody who is a male and now a female, or somebody who used to be a female and now a male, the thing is serious. So I say, do we even have judiciary in Nigeria? Is it not the same judiciary that said INEC is not bound by its decision? Electoral Act, even constitu constitution. Electoral Act, even constitution to announcing uh, election result. A country that anything goes, a lawless nation, who can believe Supreme Court? Nobody. So well said, Justice Buddy. For some, for once, something sensible is oozing out from the mouth. These people who call themselves learned and think all of us are idiots and fools. 
Yes. Okay, let's see how it goes. I hope you will use your good office to portray good image of the country if you are not removed. Hmm. What are the FBI and DSS waiting for to arrest Mr. Tinubu before he vanish into thin air? Make arrest now. Not for where? They will not do that. Labor in vain. I tell you, the Ecuadorians have come. So if I if if you like, write whatever you like. Tinubu is going no is going to it's not going anywhere. America cannot de uh, dictate how to rule our country to us. Can you imagine? Uh, somebody say Onuku. <laughs> you don't uh Onuku you don't it's a you don't know that it's a criminal offense, okay? He must go to jail. Generation of forgery. Supreme Court Justice uh will still favor Tinubu because uh we are in lawless judiciary country. Hmm. Where is Asaido Kobo? If we are to be Peter Obi, now the Asaido Kobo, the pig, will be threatening. But he cannot face Fulani before now. Eh? I'm watching Yoruba versus Fulani Supreme Court. Not be smart, you know. Eh? It is going to be something different. Someone said, don't tell any of us jump like gum for now. Tinubu's document from CSU is in possession of article. The truth shall be revealed whether the certificate is fake or real. They are already working on it. Eh? They are already working on it. That is it. So if that is truth and Tinubu forge his certificate to do something, then something is wrong. Hey, there shall be not room for such. Anybody involved shall resign or sack immediate or be sacked immediately. It is a disgrace. That's what somebody is saying here. Nigeria is in a very deep mess at this time. Hmm. Somebody say you guys are only talking about forged certificate. Have you seen the criminal record of more than 2,500 pages to be released soonest by FBI as ordered by the U.S. Uh, court magistrate, Ms. Gilbert, uh, Gilbert. I heard the record is even 7,000 pages. He go shock on now. See, Lagos State was looted by this criminal, okay, as the, as the then number one person. Let's watch and see what unfolds in the coming weeks through FBI. Bagam. Hmm. Any defending this criminal is also a criminal. Such person or group of persons are worse. This man has so degraded Nigeria outside that Nigeria stinks before other countries. The eyes of the world. Oh boy. Well, the stigma will be cleared if the judiciary send him packing from Asso Rock to jail. They will they do that? They will never do that. There is no justice uh, body in the Nigerian Supreme Court. Okay, oh. so the state of things now has shown that uh, it's going to be worse. After the CSU revelation, the FBI revelation will follow. And then I don't know where Nigeria will be. Thank you for listening and let's have your comments.